Hi everybody, my name is Eileen from ETC Paper Home Blog. Welcome to my YouTube channel. What I have here today is this Drink Mate Carbonated Drink Maker. So what I'm going to do now, open up the box, show you the item, and then set it up and then uh, tell you what I think about it. So let's take a look now. So it comes with a drink maker, um, bottles, a cap for the bottles, and the CO2 gas instruction, and a warranty card. So I have received this uh, red in colour drink mate um, Just quickly have a quick look As you can see it's uh, made from a plastic uh, material And uh, at the back here is where you put your CO2 uh, gas tank um, At the moment uh, as you can see I just need just hold with one hand you, It's very lightweight So hopefully uh, when I put the uh, CO2 gas in there It should uh, weigh it down because you don't want it to be too light, but at the same time, you don't you don't want it to be too heavy. So at the back here, which is the cover for the CO2. So uh, just open this up. Okay. And then just take this plastic off. So it just have to remove this black cap. This is what it means. Right. Um, I'm going to put this through here Once I remove the um, plastic sleeve, I just move the plastic uh, cap And you, if you can see, it's sort of um, screw tight um, canister So what I'm going to do now is just to put right at the back here Okay, like this And then I'm going to screw it Okay, right now I'm gonna put it back. So just place it like that. Cap it. So that is how uh, it's easy to install the uh, CO2 gas. And now, uh, as you can see, it's a bit heavier. Uh, that I need to use two hand to um, sort of lift up. So uh, which is quite nice because I like it to be a bit heavy. Otherwise, uh, when it's too lightweight, it will just wobble. So now th for this bottle, so um, what you have to do is just to tip this about 45 degrees and then you can hear a click and then you sort of slide this out, okay? So um, the insertion is part of the how the bottle look like, it's not part of how the uh, machine, so which is quite nice because um, you want it to be easy to wash, you don't want to start on the machine and then you have to use something to clean it. So um, this can be easily removed and then you can just simply wash it um, You cannot wash the bottles in the dishwasher so it's only hand wash uh, And on the bottle it will say that up to the maximum line here So it's about 850 ml And um, it's 100% BPA free which is good So it did come with a cap so once you're done with your guessing, you can just um, close it with this cap and then store it in your fridge. Um, according to the instruction, it said that you can also use for food juice. But if you use for food juice, you have to use those without the bits. Because those bits might clog onto the gas here. So it's best to use, if you want to use food juice, best um, those without the bits one will be good. Right, just simply take this off. And then we just pop this in like this Okay, sort of lock it And then now we just um, slide it There's two grooves here So just slide it like this So that's how the top button look like It's for you to press I'm not going to press it now Because I have the gas tank in there And then I have nothing filled in the bottle So just let you have a quick look How this thing look like It look absolutely gorgeous Now let's going to test it out so I have filled this bottle to the maximum which is 850 ml of food You can have iced tea, you can have fruit juice, you can have anything that you want uh, for this machine uh, to carbonate it obviously uh, Obviously if you use fruit juice, remember it cannot have bits in it because it might get stuck on the uh, pipe here So uh, I have filled it up uh, and I'm gonna pop it in I mean this one just screw it tight and then just pop it in like this Press it down and then I'm going to press the button 
So it recommend you about two seconds or you can have a, a longer. It depends on how, how much um, carbonate you want into your water. So I'm just gonna do um, a long one. If, some, if you can hear a, a, a leaking sound means that it's too full, okay? So now you can hear this sound, which is means that um, that's too much already. So don't pump anymore, okay? Now I'm just gonna wait for a few seconds before I pop it out. All right, just lift this and then take it out like that. Going to put this one side. Okay, on the top here, there's this slow release and then there's a fast release gas. As you can see, I have uh, released the, the gas. So that is uh, this is the slow release. So it was slowly released or you want a, a fast one, which is this one. You press it down like that. It's the fast release one, okay? Okay, now I'm just gonna take this off and then pour it into the cup like that. Not sure, can you see all this bubble in there? Okay, let me show you again. Hope you can see all the bubbles. Those tiny little bubbles in there. Yeah? Okay, anything that you don't want to use, make sure you uh, cap it tight like this. There you go. easy to push as you can see right now to take it off tip it and then sort of slot this out like this okay and then you sort of uh, give a gentle shake it will help to increase uh, the carbonate gas in there okay and um, there's a slow and the fast release so the slow release is this cap as you can see is some of the Air is uh, the gas is leaking out at the moment, okay? And then you do, then you press your fast one to make sure that it's totally uh, released, okay? Then now that how is the carbonate tea is look like? Right, that's how you can see. There's lots of bubbles. So what I think about this is that it's very easy to use and easy to maintain. I mean the button is so uh, easy to press it and, and then the sound that they make is not very loud so it's not very scary at all. And uh, best of all, this thing can be removed for washing which is great because um, I know that in some brand they are being attached there but for this one it's being removed. And uh, for this drink mate. It can also do um, food juice. Not every uh, drink maker can do uh, every, any kind of uh, drinks. So, but for this one, it can do food juice. Uh, it can do wine. It can do lots of different drinks. Um, iced tea, you know. But not not every drinks can be carbonate because not not every drink tastes nice when it's carbonate. So you sort of have to trial and error. And um, there's one thing you need to note is that some of the drinks will foam uh, much more than others. So uh, um, depends on what sort of drinks you put it. So if it's sort of um, foam quite a lot, you when you take it off the cap, you have to slowly release it. Um, if it's too much, just uh, if if the foam have reached the top, just wait for a while before you uh, release it again. Uh, and, then, and then, because sometimes you don't want it to open and it freeze out. So that's the worst thing that is such a mess. So what you have to do is just be more patient and uh, wait for the foam to sort of uh, settle down. Then you uh, take it off. So um, if you do have any question about this drink baker, uh, do let me know. 
Uh, if you want to buy it, you can buy it from Amazon. In uh, now in UK, they sell in UK, so you can get it from Amazon. Uh, if you have any uh, query, just uh, pop it on my comment page, and I'll let you know as soon as possible. So bye bye.